So you're here in beautiful Bangkok, but you only have one or two days to spend and you want to try different street food. You're always going to be able to find street food somewhere here. You might want to go to a place that has a bunch of different selections of food. Well, that's what we're going to be doing today. If you're in Bangkok, I feel like the best spot that you could accomplish that task is to go to Siam Mall. It has food from all 70 different provinces here in Thailand. Before we go though, I'm going to grab me something to eat. If there's one thing I know about Thailand and traveling around is there's tons of street food uh, and you literally can just walk down the road and find you some street food. That right there is a vendor's cart and that was five minute walk from my front door. But for me right now, I just want to get a little snack. So traffic in Thailand is a little bit rough, but you get used to it, to be honest with you. Excuse me. As long as you're kind of aware of your surroundings and um, <laughs> try to stay out of the way, should be good. I've only been hit once while I've been here in Thailand and it was nothing crazy. Somebody just clipped me on the side with their, their mirror when I was walking down the street. Swati ka. And just be nice. Learn how to say hello. Thank you. Oh, look how pretty that is. One of the things that's unfortunate about driving in Bangkok or Thailand is that it, it, I'm here during the rainy season. And at any given moment, it could just start raining, which is what it's doing right now. It's pouring cats and dogs. So, of course, I had to stop, park my bike right there. And then I'm just going to have to hold up here with my stuff and wait until the rain subsides, which I don't know, it looks like it might rain for a while. So we might be here for a while. <laughs> Hasn't gotten better. <laughs> so this is a cool little spot that I found to sit out the rain. On the way to Icon Siam, this is traveling in Bangkok, especially on a, on a scooter. If you take a grab car, you won't have to worry about this. Comes with the territory, roll with the punches. We'll make it. Well, now we're at Icon Siam, and we're in the, the motorcycle parking garage, just like every other motorcycle parking garage here. Just to let you know, there's tons of them, and the aisles are super narrow. So if you do take a bike, you gotta be good at driving it. Just to let you see, it's not very wide, not very wide at all. So you have to be good with the motorcycle if you're gonna drive one. So I can do a whole tour of this whole mall, but I'm not gonna focus on that. I'm gonna focus on going to the street food. So when you walk in the parking garage, you get to the elevators. So we're on the basement floor and then this shows you what's on each level. And we are not, I'm not gonna try to get the whole, the whole mall, but I think the place that we want to go is G uh, to try to find where all the street food vendors are at. G is where we're gonna be heading. And we're currently on P2, so we have to go up. So up, up and away is where we go. So you may or may not know that Siam, well, Takashimaya is actually a Japanese, uh, can, mm, a Japanese, I don't know what to call it, shopping mall, whatever. And it runs from the ground level all the way up to the fifth floor in this entire mall. So ground all the way up and it has everything that you could ever possibly want but we're here mainly for the food that's what we're looking for so let's see if we can find the food vendors but i love how this is set up this is laid out where you have all this stuff. Look, at, look at how many things are in here this place is chock full of stuff you can get currency exchange if you need some cash and you have all kinds of vendors in the middle here selling 
Massages. Do you want a massage while you're shopping at the mall? Oh, I can smell food. Oh yeah. Oh look how pretty. Look how pretty that is. How pretty it is. Look at the floor. They got these sparklies. Can you see that? It's sparkling. That's pretty. Experience all Thai happiness. So this is it. Every province has food represented here. Oh man. So much food. Hello. Octopus, squid. Oh, you want some, what is that, clams, oysters, mussels, snails, some shrimps, shrimp stew, shrimp biscuit, crab, crab, crab. Can get you some rice. Look at all that. Fried squid, corn and shrimp. Ooh, you get some giant shrimp. Dang, look at those things. Some giant boys. Ooh, we got some shish kebabs. Look at that. Okay, we're gonna go for this way. There's so no, much. Hey. There's so much food here. Yeah, I know. There's so many things to choose from. So this is a great representation of, you know, street food in Thailand. There's so much street food that you have to choose from. And you can, you have everything that you could possibly want. So if you were like, I don't know where to go to get street food, but I want to try a whole bunch of different stuff, you can always just come here to Icon Siam. Thank you, thank you. And they have, I mean, everything. All the stuff that you're seeing here is what I've seen, you know, on the street. These dumplings are all over Bangkok. So, <clears throat> oh, and same thing here. Normally, though, like these are about 10. It depends, the 20 for the beef. The chicken usually are about 10 a piece. But that's a decent price. Seafood, seafood, seafood. Everybody's just eating it up, having a good time. Oh, look at this. Well, they have lamb here. Rabbit. Deer. Ostrich. Pork. Beef. Oh. They even got some crocodile. You want some crocodile? Well, if you like pork, they got you covered.
So the tom yum is predominantly going to be with shrimp in it, but you can have it made without shrimp if you ask for it. Wish you happiness. Have a nice day at Susie. Thank you. It is though. It is very pretty here. So this place is massive. I can't really tell you. I can't explain to you. I can't explain to you how big it is. So they have food that's being fresh cooked, and then over here they have a complete different section where you can get all you know different kinds of packaged goods that they're they're packaging up. We'll keep walking, but. This place is pretty massive. The little river theme continues. So you can get fresh made. So, koi, koi, cow stock? Chicken beef. Seafood tom yum. Chicken beef. Tom yum? Tom yum. Beef. Chicken pork. White yellow. Sedai sen. I'll be back. I'll give back. Thank you. So, they have the soups there, and then you do get the noodles, and then ingredients that you want. And then also, you add your vegetables to it as well. It's really good. I'll probably be back to get some of that. What do we got here? Oh, bath products, all bath products. Thai people are, are really, <laughs> thankfully, they're really big on making sure that they smell good. So, oh, this is dried, like freeze dried kind of flavors. How cool is that? So, you can actually buy bags if you want to. Pork skins, pork skins, pork skins. That's cool. So this seems like a lot of dried things. What is that? Thai crisp Thai crispy pancake. Can I try one? Which one you want? Um Oh so this one's sweet? I'll try one sweet and one salty. But can I eat just one at a time? Just give me one and I'll come back. So this one, this one right here that he gave me, I think this one is sweet from what he said. Mm. So it's crunchy. Let me go over here, you out of everybody's way. Okay. So this one's crunchy. Mmm. It's like a cracker almost. Mmm. It's like a sweet cracker with marshmallow and Geez, it tastes really good. It is, it's good. Let me get the salty now. Now can I try the salty? Mmm. Kokum cup. So now, this one is the salty one. Looks like exactly the same thing, except the ingredients in the middle is a little bit different. Oh, that's really good. Yeah. Ooh. Mm. Oh, I like that one. It is salty. Oh, mango, sticky rice.
They can come over here and get. Oh, look at all of this. Same kind of thing. You just make what you want. Oh, and then added ingredients that you could put on yourself. Yeah, interesting, interesting. If you wanted to risk it for the biscuits, you could get you some durian because they have it here. Look at that. It doesn't really smell that much though. I don't know why. Normally the fresh stuff smells a lot worse. Interesting. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's like a it's like a pear. More fresh fruit. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Pass through. Oh, more durian. Look, some people really like it, but some people don't. I've had it. It tastes like yogurt. I had a video on it that I'll, if I can think of it, post it somewhere here. But it's got like a yogurt kind of consistency to it when it's in your mouth. But then again, it has flavors that almost smell like rotten meat, but it doesn't taste like that. I am getting so hungry though. We have got to get something to eat. <clears throat> there are so many food choices here. So, without a doubt. Look, they got little can. Look at that. So, Arika. Oh man, look at these desserts. That looks so delicious. Dried mangoes. Oh, and we have some nice pastries too over here if you wanted. Look at that. Mm. <laughs> so you have really some really, really nice food you could indulge on here if you wanted to. And it lets you try every every different food that you could possibly find. Oh, there's so much food here. Sushi, if you wanted some sushi. They got sushi here. So, there's so much stuff. There's almost too many food choices to choose from, if I'm being completely honest. And it's pretty massive. I mean, look, you got ice cream. Bento boxes from Japan. That's actually, holy cow, there's so much food here. Pastries, do you want some pastries? Do you try to get some pastries up in you? I'm telling you, they have so many food items here and things that you probably never, Sawarika, probably never seen. So much meat. Oh my gosh. Oh, and then the grocery store. <laughs> So I found, I found what I'm gonna get. Um, green curry over here, if you haven't had it, is amazing. And that's what I'm wanting. So I'm gonna go with some green curry. They have so many different types of green curry here that you can get. So they have all the soups and then they have the ingredients that you put into it. So I'm gonna chow down on this. So I'm getting the green.
I'm getting the green curry. Oh, is it okay if I leave it there? I'm getting the green curry and then I found right across the way they have uh, spring rolls and like fried stuff. So I'm gonna get some of this as well to go with it. Got a little spot to eat and I have my setup. I'm so hungry, I haven't eaten all day. Um, it's a little table. Let me see if you guys can see it here. Very tiny little table. And I'm sharing it with a couple of people and she actually has another one. So you see this little, little table and then they have this, remember how I told you? China? No, neither one. About the little river. So they got the little river going right there. So I get to look at all of this while I eat. Yes, but I am originally from Algeria. I'm originally from Algeria. Algeria. Africa. Africa. North, North Africa. Oh. But I, I live in Denmark. You live in Denmark? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Denmark is very nice. Boring. Oh. It's boring. Really. There's nothing. Nothing? No, I prefer Asia, Southeast Asia. You, you like the live here in Thailand? I like the vibe. The vibe. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Denmark is, it has been before. A long time ago, it was very good. Yeah. Now, now? Uh, everything is expensive and it's boring. Yeah, yeah. Holland is, uh, is too. Where is There is the no, night, no nightlife. No, no. No nightlife. You know, when you, when you finish working, then you go home and have a dinner. Yes. You, you have not uh, yeah, use my chopsticks. nightlife. Yep. Yeah, yeah. You know? I love uh, And a nightlife is the spicy. Yeah. Have, yeah. Oh, there it is. Southeast Asia is very, you know, I have been here since 1999, every year. In Thailand? Thailand, uh, two, yeah. three, four months. You know, I stay and go home again. Oh, yeah. I like Thailand. Yeah. I love, mm. I love uh, especially Thailand. I love Thailand. Uh, I love Thailand, yeah. Uh, Thailand is good eating, Every, very good. Everything. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, but, but, but are you originally from where? Uh, from China. 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 Yeah. Yeah, 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 of course. Of course. Yeah. Now I've been here on a holiday. Oh, holiday. Uh, first, uh, first China. Yes. And then, uh, yeah, Chongqing. Do you, uh, you know Chongqing? Uh, no. You know Chongqing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Chongqing, Sichuan, and Hainan, and then, and then uh, here Thailand. And then, uh, How do you say Han Hano? How do you say Hano? Hano? Hano. Oh. Hano. Sanya. Mm. Yeah, I know. You know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't been to China yet, though. <laughs> I do. How long stay here? A month. One month. Yeah. Before here, I was in Phuket. Phuket, yes. Three weeks. Ah. And then before that, I was in the Philippines. Philippines. For one month. Oh, you do the vlog. The what? For vlogger. Vlog. I, I vlog, but it's just for my mom. Yeah? Because my mom wants to see my... Oh, your mom? My mother. Your mother? Yes. Ah. Uh, I stay here, this hmm. one. Where are you from? America. Where are you from? America? I'm a traveling ICU nurse, so I go all over the America. Yeah, yeah. from California? Or? I live in my car. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look, I take uh, I take my yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. I have been uh, I have been traveling a lot in the USA. You have? Yeah. Do Before you... I drove from uh, San Francisco to Santiago, all the coast. Yeah. Okay. Many years ago. California is expensive. Yes. Shit. Oh. I think it's in the water. No, it's underneath that oh. chair. Don't worry about it. I guess. Yeah. No, yeah. so I. Uh, it was in 1996. It's a very long, long time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Florida, I drove also in Texas. Oh. Yeah, San Antonio to uh, Austin a long way. I worked in San Antonio. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I like very much. I like, the, you know, the country music in San Antonio. Is very and my popular. daughter, they have a boyfriend, ex-boyfriend. Yeah. He is uh, living in New York. Right. And my mother. 
I hate New York. Huh? I hate New York. I hate yeah. New York. Yeah. I yeah. do not like not New York. Yeah. people like New York. Yeah. Either, either you like New York or you don't like New York. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah? In America, you either yeah. hate no. New York yeah. or you love New York. Yeah? yeah. yeah? Exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. My doctor, she is no like. She said, no, it's too busy. Too busy. It's a very big city, yes. Yeah, yeah. And the people wants, are really yeah, rude yeah, in New York. Really yeah. rude in New York. And she said, yeah, I live, I live in a year, I think, the butter. <coughs> I think... Relax, relax life, you know. Uh, sleep and uh, live in butter. Relax. I like Denmark. The problem, you know, there is not so many places where you can go. In Copenhagen. Very small. Everything is so small. But the Americans, they love the uh, Copenhagen. American people, they love, uh, they love the Copenhagen. Really? Yes. Oh, yeah, they love it. Hello? They love the wow. uh, architect like yeah, architecture. Yeah. Yeah, yeah sure, sure. sure. Uh, they love the architecture. Uh, Thank you. Thanks. Now, enjoy. And the way, the character. The character of the dance. They are very quiet, you know. Very patient, you know. In Copenhagen? Yeah. Yeah. yeah the people are very, you know, quiet. You know, it's similar to America. If you yes. go up north, America, yeah. everything's busy, busy, busy. Yeah. Yeah. More south you go, yes. slows down. Exactly. More yeah, easy. Yeah, so. More friendly, too. Exactly. exactly. Oh, yeah, I travel a lot in uh, Chicago. I, I, I like Chicago very much. You like Chicago? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the city, the people. Yeah, I know, I know. Outside is a little bit, you know, dangerous. It's dangerous, yeah. But, but the architecture in Chicago is much better than New York. And most of the architecture, you know, the, the, the people who has, uh, it's from Europe. Uh -huh. Yeah, the architects. Uh, I think there is three women. They made the uh, uh -huh. big buildings in Chicago. You know. Very popular, from Europe. French lady and Italian, and another Italian lady. Mm. Uh, they built the big uh, skyscraper. Yeah, when I think of Europe, I think of beautiful architecture. Yeah, oh, I, <laughs> Spain. Spain and... Uh, France. Unbelievable. I love it. You know, the Rococo style. Yeah. And the details, all the details, you know, is unbelievable. Why do you like Thailand? I like Thailand because of the vibe. You know, most people come to Thailand because of the vibe. You know, the, uh, you know everything is open, you know, and, and, and they, they party everywhere. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Really, yeah. You know. You know, there is party everywhere. Somebody's playing guitar here, you know. I like that. I like that very much. Mm -hmm. That's what uh, brings me here. Yeah. Say hello. Oh. Hello. I'm going to Pattaya ne uh, next week. Oh, you're going to Pattaya? Yeah, I'm going to uh, have uh, rent an apartment. Are you going to see, are you going to see uh, Mu Dang? Uh, oh, yeah, 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 sure, sure. The sure. pig? The hippo? Yeah, 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 yeah. Say hi. hi. Hello. Hi. Are you, are you sugar? Yeah, my mother. For your mother? Yeah, my mom. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Meeting these wonderful people. I come from China. <laughs> I you, come from Holland. You're from Holland? Yeah, from Holland. Me too. Oh. Yeah. And then you're from Cop. I am originally from Algeria, um, North Africa, but I have lived in Denmark 54 years. Okay. All my life. You know. I, I came to Denmark when I was 19, 19 years old. From now I am 75. 
75. Yeah. You look good for 75. <laughs> you came from Denmark from where? Copenhagen. Ah, okay. Yes. Now I'm 75 years old. I, 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 uh, I just enjoy life, you know, of course. Yeah, I'm an old man. <laughs> yeah, that's what you should do. Enjoy yourself. You have to do, because yeah. life is very short. Believe me. Yeah? <laughs> I'll be 48. Oh, uh, yeah, you're young. My daughter, she's 52. I have a daughter, she's 52. Mm. But uh, you're still young, you can do a lot. A lot of yeah, that's why I'm traveling. I have been traveling, traveling all over the world. If I didn't do it, I would regret it very much. Yeah. So I really, uh, I'm happy I, I've done all that. You know? Do it while you can. Yeah. I, have, I, have, I have visited 75 countries. 75 countries I have visited. Wow. Yes. Anywhere. Yeah. But what have you been doing the uh, videos, uh, YouTube videos here? Everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah. Everywhere you know I go. The guy with uh, the beer. Well, Chris. Chris. <coughs> You know, Chris, very popular. I, I just make these for my mom. Okay. I don't really watch it. Oh, you don't uh, earn money for, from YouTube. Okay. And I don't make any money. Because no you, money. You, you can, you, you can, uh, In uh, America, please stand. Do you think <coughs> Paris or uh, Trump? What do you think? You mean Kamala? Uh, Kamala or Trump? Yeah. Today, today's the day. Today's the day? Yeah. Today's the day. Yeah. Who, who, who what time is it? But nobody has uh, won. Uh, yeah, right now, know. right now it's 4 a.m. in America. So uh, yeah, the results results won't be done tomorrow, for huh? yeah till tomorrow. So, yeah, it's gonna be one of them. One of them. They don't know exactly is in the balance. You know, is very. I think in the hardest. You think it's gonna Kamala? Yeah. Yeah. All the women, all the women who vote for her, uh, Harris. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry, but I can. I, I am a Trumpist. I, I vote for Trump. Trump? Why? Because they have never given him a chance. You know, when COVID come to to America, you know, all the work was, you know, stopped. See, he didn't get the chance to be finished, you know, his policy. And everybody is after him, you know. Can, can I ask y'all a, a question? <coughs> this, is for, this is for all of you. Can I ask you all a question? I, one thing that I've noticed, like I'm an American, is there's so many people that are invested, interested in the presidential election. I don't understand why, though. Because uh, America is uh, very important for all the all the, all the world economically. You know the economic the economy is in America. You know the the, the what do you call that? Uh, this is why you support Trump. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. I think if if Her if uh, Kamala wins, <coughs> yeah, it won't be good for the economy. No, exactly. Yeah. Because. Uh, you know, all the world is uh, dependent of, uh, of, uh, of the economy of America. Okay. You know. Many things can happen. Because when, when, when I talk and people find out that I'm from America, yes. Yes, yes, yes. they always bring up the, the election. Like they're concerned or invested in it, and I don't understand why. But yeah. that makes sense. And the stock market, if the stock mar market go down in the USA, all the world will go down. Yeah, I, I trade on the stock market. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You know, that's why the people are interested. You know. oh. But I think, I think there is another kind of people who is, uh, which is interested. It's uh, what do you call that? Uh, uh, the rich and the poor. The ri yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's okay. Hello? Very hard. Yeah, <laughs> I'm spicy. Very spicy. Oh. 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 oh.
Maroc. And there is uh, something about the lifestyle, you know, because there is uh, the poor people and the rich people. Well, the rich people have the tendency to, to vote for Trump because they, they, it's, they're wealthy, you know, they have a lifestyle. So they prefer Trump. You know what I mean? Actually, in America, a, yeah. I think more poor people yeah. prefer Trump. Oh, yeah, yeah, they do yeah. now because of the situation in the USA now. Yeah. You know. They, do, they didn't do it before, but now they do it because Trump became, uh, uh, what do you call that? He's a businessman, you know, he can uh, do many things. Yeah. Yeah. Because Trump, do you, gave, uh, Trump gave uh, more power. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 He's very powerful, very rich man. Yeah. I have been in, uh, I have seen all his hotels in, in Las Vegas. I have seen it in uh, Chicago, the big, uh, big Trump Trump Tower you know? in Chicago, Atlanta, you know, the, the Taj Mahal and all that. I think what, what I think what Americans like about Trump is yeah. the fact that, you know, Trump is not like a politician. And when I think about politicians, yeah. politicians don't care about me, you, regular they people. Too much. They just talk, and they want they want to make money. Trump already has all the money, so the he wants to help. Uh, you know, they're playing with words. You know, they're nice words. You know, you know, nice sentences. You know, and uh, and, and it's, it's, that's uh, uh, an intellectual word. You know, mm -hmm. well, it's good to be, it's good to be intellectual. It's not, no problem. But but you have to do something. You cannot just talk and use the fine word. You know, you have to to act. You know what I mean? So yeah. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Yeah. yeah. Who's the president of um, Denmark? Uh, it's, uh, it's a lady. Oh, uh, lady? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what do you call her? Oh, God. Christensen. Chris, Christensen. Christensen? Yeah, yeah. And then for China, who's the president of China? I don't know that. I don't know that. Yeah. The president. Yeah, Xi Jinping. Xi Jinping? Xi Jinping. Xi Jinping. And then how about... I don't like. Oh, you don't like? Uh, Xi Jinping, in Chinese people, yeah. I say, 70% no like. Oh. Oh. Because uh, the public yeah. uh, no talk Xi. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. But it's, uh, she is... Uh, uh, that was a year ago, so now, uh, uh, king. king. Yeah. He, uh, he is king. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What he inside what is, is uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. no people, you, together, but, yeah, yeah. Oh. go. Yeah, yeah, I understand. It's I've, heard, I've heard that about China. And, uh, no, no more is, for instance, is, uh, two, two year, two time, yeah? yeah. yeah? Then, it's a change. There is no free speech. Now it's a, free, free yeah. speech. Yeah. No now free it's speech. A, now it's he is yeah. died. Yeah. Then change. Wow. It's not good. It's like in Russia. Right? Yeah. It's the oh same. yeah, with Putin. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Putin's yeah, there forever, right? Yeah, yeah. Are you guys okay? You look like huh? your eyes are watering. Yeah. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. I get your 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 eyes like. No, my eyes. No, 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 no. Okay. No, no. It's okay. It's a lecker. Very good. It's very good. Yes. For me, it's not too hot. No, she is too very hot. Bad. Yes, I drink some yeah, water. I, I, yeah, that's why I was worried. I have been in China. I've been in uh, Beijing. Shanghai, yeah. Hong Kong, yeah. Shangju. Ah. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, very much. How are the people? Are the people nice? Yeah, it's okay. Mm. Yeah, the public is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the people are good? Yeah, the people are good. Very nice. Very nice I'm, I'm scared to go to China. No, 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 no. Don't do it. No? Uh, you have to, you have to. There's a lot, a lot of things to see in Beijing to and Shanghai, you know, Shanghai, oh, very, very nice city. Kutong, you know, the very big, city, big. very big. And uh, you would like it.
very, very nice. And the hotel are very nice hotels, you know, they have. Mm. And uh, they have a big marketing by June, uh, uh, I don't remember the name, where you can buy street food. You know, uh, how is the best place there? Teng Xiaoping. Teng Xiaoping is yeah. very good, yeah, yeah, very yeah, yeah. good. In Beijing, the, uh, I was in big market, you know, they have everything. You, what's the name of the big uh, shopping mall? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, near the le lake. You know, there's a yeah, 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 mall, mall, yeah, mall. Yeah, yeah. It's this one. Yeah. Mm. No, don't. No I don't problem. like the mall. I don't like mall. Okay. I like the shopping. That is good. Yeah, yeah. but that I like I like very much Beijing too. Yeah. Yes. Very much. There's a lot to see. Many things to see. No, 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 the people are okay. No problem. You can, uh, you can use uh, Alipay. I have Alipay when I was yeah. in China. Now, ah. you know, and that is for China, on that, uh, because uh, uh, she wants uh, the people, the people will, will uh, see what to do. Ah. And then uh, she is uh, Alipay. We yeah. chat, yeah, yeah, we, yeah. we we pay, we pay, yeah, yeah, we pay. Yeah. They can see what you what from the what from the money, or where is the uh, what what control. what you, yeah control. Yeah. control. Oh, you uh, you now sit down mm. in here. Mm. Then and she can can this see. That's no good. They and, you. Uh, and and then uh, and now and I go China holiday. Uh, first week week. I can uh, pay, and uh, I pay only uh, yes. cash, yes. you oh, know, okay. and uh, more people yes. that have no uh, change, change the money, giving me back, because every day people, we chat are pay, we chat are pay, we pay, you know, we pay and uh, yeah, but it's Everything. easy. It's easier with anything. It's very easy, and I, I know like, oh, okay. and uh, you know, and uh, we we pay. Yeah. You you must use number. <laughs> Two waters. Two waters. Oh, oh, here we go. How much are they? One ten baht, two twenty baht. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Cheers. This was very good herbal. herbal. Her I was going to get that, that herbal very drink. Very so, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm always concerned about, you know, if I go to a country, because Americans have a, we have a reputation, you know, where some people don't like us, and I don't want to go to a country where they don't like me. Like, if they're Chinese, I, I don't know if you're Chinese, but you look Chinese. So if they came to America, people would look at them and be like, they're Chinese. There's some places in America where they don't like Chinese people. There was some no. problem here. So. Yeah. And in the and and Netherlands, Holland, the people very nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sh uh, Holland say, say Chinese hot work, yeah. uh, work only work and pay for the plastic and uh, mm -hmm. for, uh, for Holland. And uh, nice and uh, everything, uh, everything, seat. Hello, yeah. you know, and uh, very, very social. That's, social, how it, social, social, uh, that's how it should be. When yeah. when other humans travel around the planet, yeah. they should be welcome. Yeah. You know? And, uh, you know, and I, I go in a, in a school for my children, a new uh, people call me, uh, the children, the mother, yes. father, they go to, uh, go to, uh, go to me, say, oh, Welcome, you know, and oh. then uh, you you put and uh, 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 welcome. Welcome. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but you have. Yeah, but
The problem uh, is the media who, who has created yes, yes. all those things. You know? Because the people, we, we're talking since from China and from India, you know, America, you know, we were having fun, you know? Yeah. But the media can destroy everything. They you can. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Everybody tells me Trump's a fascist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trump's not a fascist. <laughs> no, of course not. But this is terrible because, uh, you, especially CNN, huh? CNN, they, 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 you know, they, uh, I stopped watching the news in America ten years yeah, ago. Really, I don't watch. I don't watch the news anymore. Yeah. yeah. But uh, you know, the media has destroyed many things. Yeah. Hello, Scott. Yes. Hello, Susan. We're today here. Here, here. I'm here. 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 My husband. Are oh, your husband? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah.大台啊，我哋。大台啊，大台食饭啊，唔系啊，呢老鬼就偷老啊，偷老啊喺度。偷老啊喺度。佢话辣到咧，辣到只呢鬼喺度喊啊。How long are you gonna be here? One month. Four. Yes. I have to go to Pattaya two months. I have rent a big apartment and uh, I have to come back to Bangkok. I have to find another apartment here, you know, to stay two months here. So I go back uh, the 15th of March. What are you going to do about your, your visa? Oh, I have uh, uh, two entries. Visa. I have to go out to Cambodia one day and come back again and they get more. Okay. Uh, two entries. Okay. Because yeah. one, one entry gives you two months? Uh, I, bought it. I bought it in Denmark, the visa. You know, I gave uh, 5,000 baht. 5,000. Uh, 5,000. 5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。5,000。
Oh, it's good. Now let's try the green one. <clears throat> oh, it tasted like coconut. So this is the green one. Mm. So they both have coconut in them. Mm, they're okay. Neither one I thought was that great. But it does taste like coconut for sure. Okay, let's see what else. Look how crazy it is in here. So much food. Hello. Hello, hello. Sawadee ka. Coconut. Sticky rice. Mango sticky rice. Super popular. The different flavors. Butterfly tea, turmeric, coconut milk, hand on. Black glutinous rice. Ooh I wonder, can I just get the rice without the mango? Uh, it's so big. You have something small. You know what? You could just put it in a bag. Just a bag. Bag's okay. Bag okay. Bag okay. Okay, yes. Chai. Okay, so I asked her if I could just get the sticky rice because I don't really want the mango. And she said yes. I mean, everything's got a price. So I got a whole bunch of sticky rice for 100 <clears throat> baht. Look at these, you can get some little 30 baht per pieces. Daifuki. Oh, a little strawberry inside. How cool is that? Ooh, I know everybody knows macaroons. Oh, so much to see here. <clears throat> crispy butter rolls. Look at crispy butter rolls. Well. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So there's so much to see here. I can't stay and look at everything because I gotta get back to the house. But just to let you know, there is. There's tons of things to see here. Uh, I'm gonna try to find my way back to the parking garage because I gotta get back to the house. But you can make a whole day here. And look, we only went through one little part of one floor of Icon Zion. I'll have to come back and see if we can see other things here, but <clears throat> there's so much to see here. I could fill up a whole video with different things to see in this place. I don't even think I'm going the right way right now. The veranda. <clears throat> Look at how pretty it is in here. Oops, sorry.
and I gotta go. So I wish I could show you more, but I have to head on back. It's getting late, so we're going back down to the parking garage. Gonna hop on the bike and then head back to the house. I will catch you guys in another video. This was the short little Icon Siam food tasting place. But if you wanted to try, you know, different street foods, this seems like the most convenient way to do it. They have everything that I've seen on the street here. So it's in a nice location and it's air conditioning. And that's, that's nice. You don't have to struggle outside. So, all right. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Remember that sticky rice that I got? Well, I made it back home. Check it out. It's pretty. Yeah, doesn't that look pretty? Beautiful. Gorgeous. So let's try some. So I think we'll go for the, the yellow first. It's pretty. Hmm. Oh. Hmm, that's really good. Almost a little sweetness to it. And then I'll get the purple one. You guys remember what the purple one was? I can't remember. If I'm being honest, they taste very similar. <laughs> Next one, let's do the blue. It won't focus. Oh, it did. For a second. Blue. Hmm. Are they supposed to taste different? Because they kind of taste the same. I think maybe it's just the coloring. Here's pink. Hmm. No, no. Yeah, I think they just taste the same. Green. Hmm. Yeah. Last one is this black one. Oh. Oh yeah. That one tastes different. That one has, uh, it's, um, wow, it's, what is that? How do I describe it? Hmm. Almost like a smoking, like a campfire. And sweet. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's my favorite. Okay. Anyway, sticky rice. Try it when you come here. It's pretty good. This was three dollars. Yeah, actually less than three dollars. All right, catch you in the next video.